Revolution Music and Dance, and this is our brand new line dance called Cardinal Tease. This goes to the Jesse James song, Wanted. This is a four wall, 32 count. We're gonna say beginner, beginner, line dance. There is one tag in it that happens at the end of wall seven. We'll cover that after we get through the teach. So, your first eight counts, what you're going to do is you're going to step to the side with your right foot, touch your left next to your right, step your left to the side, touch your right foot next to your left, and then do a Lindy triple step, however you want to call it, to the right. Right together, right, then rock back on your left foot, recover on your right. Now I'm going to cover just a little bit of styling on this before I turn around and show you how it looks. When you're doing your step touches, okay, you can add a little bit of styling into that, kind of like a white guy at a pop club kind of dance thing with the step and touch and step and touch. And with your rock recover at the end of your Lindy, you had your Lindy and you're rocking back, you can actually rock behind and that'll actually cause your momentum because we're going back to the left. So your first eight counts from behind, we're starting with our right step and touch. We're going right and touch, left and touch, right together, right, rock, recover. I'll do that one time with count. Ready? And one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight. Okay, your second set of eight is pretty much just like your first set of eight. You're coming off your rock, recover, you're going to step your left to the side and touch. Step your right to the side and touch, doing Lindy, Shuffle, Chasse, whatever you want to call it, to the left, left together, left. Only this time, when we do our rock recover, we're going to make a quarter turn. So you want to open up and rock back on your left as you make a quarter turn to your right. And there again, the styling that I said before I showed it, show the right side to you applies to here. You can do the white guy in a pop club, step and touch and step and touch. Okay, so from behind, we just finished up with our Lindy to the right, our rock recover. So we're going left, touch, right, touch, side to the other side, rock with a quarter, recover. I'll do that one more time with count. Ready, and one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight. Okay, we're on to our third set of eight. We just finished up, we had our Lindy, we're rocking into our quarter turn, recover. We're going to take walking steps forward, but this is going to be a little bit unique. Now, you'll see on the sheet that it's step, hold, step, hold, then quick steps, right, left, right out to the side and hold. Okay, from behind, we just finished up with our rock recover. We're going step, hold, step, hold, quick, quick, side, hold. I'll do that one time with count, then I'll tell you about some styling on this. So we're in our rock recover. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now for some styling on that, uh, you have to keep with the spirit of the dance and the spirit of the title of the da this dance, that you want this to be really seductive. So there's a couple different ways that you can style this section. When you do your step forward, you can kind of slide your foot up like you're walking seductively towards somebody, doing the same thing on the left, and then you're quick, quick, you're rushing in to get right in front of them. And a lot of the styling that you do can be through facial expressions. So you want to look at them like, oh yeah, I'm gonna come get you. Yeah, I'm coming to get you, oh yeah. Okay, some of the other things that you can do instead of just straight walking forward, you can step to the side, step to the side, and then quick, quick forward. Or, we just had a rock back, we can cross it and cross it and quick, quick out. It's all up to you how you want to style this section. 
Okay, now we're into our final set of eight. <coughs> um, this is where the dance kind of gets a little bit sexy. We just had our step and hold out to the side. We're going to bump our hips to the right twice, bump, bump, then back to the left twice, bump, bump, and then roll it around counterclockwise from left to right to left, left to right to left. And you want to make sure that your weight ends up on your left foot. So from behind, the last set of eight is bump, 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 and roll, and roll, with our weight ending up on our left. I'll do that one time with count. Ready? And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, that's the entire dance. Now, for the tag, the tag happens at the end of the seventh wall. Um, you'll actually really hear this in the music. Um, it'll feel like you should be doing this a little bit sooner, but don't worry about it. Let her get through, put your mouth on my lips or her hands on my hips, something like that, and she'll repeat that about three times. Finish out the dance on the seventh wall. Let her get through that. Put your hands on my hips, your mouth on my lips, something like that. Let her do that one time. On the second one, you're want, going to want to start the dance over, but instead you'll just go step, touch, step, touch, bump, 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 and roll it around twice. So you're going to have your start and your finish for your tag. So just so we can go through that, we just finished up with bump, 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 roll, and roll. We're going step, touch, step, touch, side, bump, 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 and roll, and roll. Okay, that's the entire dance. Uh, feel free to rewind this video if you didn't catch something. Uh, for a copy of the step sheets, you can contact me at ptesper at gmail.com. And don't forget to join us on Facebook at the Redneck Revolution of Music and Dance with Pat Esper. We'll see y'all out on the dance floor.